you say? Keeping it real, keeping it you. What's that you say? Keep hey, we are here with a very, very talented, talented yeah. woman, Brooke Fox. Give it Woo! up for Brooke Fox. Well, I've known you for so long, and I haven't seen you in a long time. You look amazing. Thank but you. I can't remember how we met. I was trying to think of this, too. Because I've known you. Is it CD Baby? Was it one of those Probably. things? Probably. It was very early on in my illustrious New York yeah, yeah, I know. I met you. Uh, I, 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 and we used to cross paths like yeah. by accident. We run into I feel each like other. Like there was a show at, at B Bar once, maybe. Oh, or B Bar on Allen, maybe. Mm. Or, or, or yeah, well, I feel like there was a show. We did a show at some point. That's where we met, possibly. Uh, and I feel like it involved Frank. Frank I mean, Wood. Wood. Yeah. Oh, was maybe. he ever at B Bar? I don't know. Oh, Beauty Bar. Oh, Beauty Bar was Different. not. Yeah, but I never, not no, that no. long ago. I okay. played there more okay. recent than okay. that. But anyway, yes. now you're like doing amazing, and well, you're I very can. clever. Well, I try. Yes, <laughs> and, and I love your motto. Can you can you tell it? Oh, um, I'm trying to think of which one. Well, give a few because you have a few really okay. clever ones. Um, this is uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. It's a good question. Uh. I think this has to do with my albinism, I'm guessing, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, there's lots of them. There is, uh, you know... Uh, oh, man, I'm trying to think of them. You don't use them anymore? I, I haven't used them in a while. Ah, so see? That's how long I know you. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay, wait. I think I want. I mean... Well, Brooke plays uh, not only guitar, but keyboards and singles. And yeah. Yeah. I do a little bit of everything. And you win things, don't you? Haven't you I won awards? I won a couple of things. I did. I I won randomly won uh, best vocal jazz arrangement oh, for a song of mine in the the Just Plain Folks Award. Oh, yeah. Just Plain yeah. Folks! Oh, I, I remember them. You yeah. won too. You got best rock band. <laughs> you still staying in touch with them? A little bit. A little bit. Yeah. 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 And I've done like the whole, you know, like. I thought about the American Song Contest and all that fun stuff. Wow. So, wow. Where, where are you from? from? I'm from Northern California, right. originally. And does it rain in Northern California? It does. It does. It <laughs> never <laughs> rains in Southern California, right? <laughs> <laughs> it never rains. I think yeah. that's the best green out there. You know what's so funny? Is like there's, yeah. there's like a bona fide rain season in Northern California, but every time I'm there and it rains, my mother's like, I can't believe it. Oh, really? Like, it's near Oregon. Yeah. Uh, like, are you that far? Not that far. Yeah, maybe we're maybe like an hour and a half or something. Oh, okay. Yeah. All yeah. Right. But the, it does rain up there a lot. It's yeah. It's funny. She's always like, I can't believe it's raining. Where's she from? Uh, Well, she was mostly raised there in California, but then she. Because you put on a little accent when you speak like your mother. Oh, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> so I was wondering where is she from? It's a mom accent, I guess. Oh. She's, a, she's from all over. She's like a military brat. And oh. Yeah. 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 So do you go back and visit often? I do. I go a couple times a year. Do you play out there? I do. There's a, you know, a couple hometown spots I like to hit. Yeah. But it's always interesting finding musicians out there because there's, you know, there's like a little network that I have to kind of sort of sure. plug myself into when I go. But right. But it's good. It's a nice, it's always a fun crowd, and usually, like, my cousins and all their babies come, and it's just uh, fun. It's usually more like a hometown show, you know? Yeah. We, like, my, my sister will, like, work the concession stand, and that's nice. You know, so it'll just be fun. So she takes fun. care of you. Yeah, it's a fun little hometown. That's good. So what's your next gig here in New York? That's an excellent question. Uh, I've been super wrapped up with, um, with uh, my, my fancy job lately, so I've just Can you, do you want to share yeah. with my fancy job? Sure. Right. What is your fancy job? This is how I job? know Johnny, actually. Uh, All right, let's I'm hear it. I'm currently running a nonprofit called Visionary Media. All right, Ooh, is Latchy in that? Oh, yeah, well, yeah, she's been with our artists in the chat. So. Right, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're, you know, we're a nonprofit for musicians who are blind or visually impaired. So we have Now, how visually impaired do you have to be? Legally blind or more. Now, what is exactly legally blind? Just Are you kids. legally blind? I am legally That's blind. That's what I thought. It makes yeah. kids on a car. But well, you yeah. oh. might be able to ride So they don't have cars for them? You, you can't yeah, drive They will soon. They will soon. I what, would you just not. plug it in and you push no, where you want to go? The whole future is going to be about nobody will drive a 
anything you learn. That's what I mean. There probably won't be any accidents. Computers will drive for you. Yes, yeah. right. right. They've already yeah. tested it. Yeah, and it's like a little above the ground. It's like, are there tires? It's a real car. Or is it like it's completely the... run by a computer. You can get in, but you so don't It's not like the Jetsons? No. It doesn't fly. No, it doesn't But it will. No. It will. No. They tested uh, it on Can you see them flying on a Jersey Turnpike? Oh high. my god, no. You don't need to worry about the black ice. I'll wait to see if they tested it on the highway, but whether or not you can negotiate New York City streets, that remains to be well, seen. Well, yeah. So, okay, so you can't drive, and you I can't drive. drive. No. I can yeah. drive, so I guess I'm not legal. No, you wouldn't yeah. get it. Huh? Yeah. yeah. It's not really like, I can't wow. see very it's well anymore. They got, they got rehearsal studios, and they had a recording studio. Oh, you mean you got the visionary? Yeah, yeah. I host the jam on Monday nights. Yes, you do. And, uh, and where is this? This is uh, inside the Collective School of Music, which is can anyone six come? Avenue. Yeah, uh huh. Sure. We have a Monday night jam every Monday night, six to nine. It is, is that the drummers uh, collective? Yes. 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 Ah, oh, yeah, it's two floors. actually inside of the of the drummers collective. Is it that six little Avenue. intersection? Ah, right up the block. block. Yeah. Yeah. What? Wow. Oh, wow. So, all right. And, and, and how long has it been there? Because I know someone who went to the drummer's club many, many years ago, okay. and um, I, I yeah. don't know if that was there yet. Well, it was there, and then they moved up to 18th Street, and now they're back. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. So what, what exactly yeah. do you do with this, and with how did you fall into it? So, uh, well, I'm, I'm running the joint now, but I, I started as an artist there, just right. like Johnny in 2009, and... Um, you know, just as a singer songwriter, and I got involved with all the showcases and you know, good for you, you know, all the things that visionary got to songwriters group, all the things we did, right? And yeah, we have a songwriters class, yeah, there's songwriters yeah. class, yeah, every week. And uh, shout out to Tony Kniff, the guard songwriting teacher. Yeah. And uh, yeah, and so we, uh, I just sort of like slowly and surely got more involved over over the years, and they needed somebody to come in and support their executive director. And when I came in, the timing was right, and they good for you. Out. So you love it. I do. That's wonderful. Right. Yes. So, but it puts you on the back burner for performing and playing. Well, yeah, a little bit. I mean, you know, it's just one of those things where I always started doing this about a year and a half ago. Okay. So I'm still kind of in the beginning phases of like deciding what we want to do with you know with visionary in the next five years and figuring out how to expand it. And so it's sort of just like you know, go ahead. I think I was just gonna say uh, two, three times a year to do the showcase. Yes. Come down and hear the visionary yeah. arts. Do you know when the next one will be? She's working. Um, working on we're working on getting the turtles into Philly. That's the big thing right now. So yeah, we're always like turtles. Yeah. We're working on we put out showcases with the turtles and we also have a showcase in the works um, on Long Island. Um, so, you know, the fundraiser showcase. So, did you say in Philadelphia? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, you so you organize for people to perform in various places yeah. as well. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, Good yeah. for you. Yeah, all over the place. That's yeah. great. Yeah, it's fun. It's a really amazing group of people. Everyone is so, so talented. I mean, you have Johnny here, who's yeah. amazingly talented. I know, I know that. Blessing, I can for Johnny. Blessing offers some people being watched The Voice this last season, and he was one of our, he's one of our Oh, artists. yeah. I can't say that I've watched The Voice, but that's <coughs> wonderful. Yeah. yeah. How that's far did he cool. get? Really far. I think he got, he got a bunch of shows, like three more shows. Yeah, that's wonderful. So he has a good career going right yeah. now. Yeah. That's yeah. wonderful. Yeah, so he's Now he's that. legally blind? He's totally blind. He's yeah. totally blind. Mm -hmm. So he can definitely not drive a car. He cannot drive a car, although maybe you'll see a picture of him on Instagram in his in a car, like just like just kidding. Oh, yeah. no, that's yeah. funny. Yeah, that's funny. Yeah. Wow. Johnny, you ever tried driving a car? Ever oh yeah, yeah. yeah. I've uh, when I uh Cody I, Allen? No, when I was playing with Nick Taylor. Um Wait, I got right. in the car and I told the so where the movies right? were loading the equipment. And um I was driving and, and I said, Okay, I'll see you guys later and then we Drove down and pulled me to the corner, then I got out. But it looked, it looked like to everybody, I was driving home. That's so, amazing. Yeah, so that's <laughs> that is the appropriate reaction. And one time, I, um, I drove the car in the parking lot. He wants these granola bars, you see. One time, I drove the car in the parking lot in the bass player's car. And the roadie thought he'd be funny and run in front of the car, except well, I didn't want to hit anything, so I kept turning left, and he kept running left. <laughs> it looked like I was going to run him over. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Well, 
What? Yeah. I've been known to almost knock people over in golf carts, but that's a separate oh, story. Wow. Yeah. Well, let's hear it because it is this National Granola Bar Day. Oh. Would okay. you like a peanut butter or a chocolate chip? I would like. Chocolate chip. Uh, there you go. It's Ooh. delicious. There you go. Thank you. So, uh, yes, would you share a skeleton from your closet? A skeleton from my closet. Uh, besides the fact that I almost ran over my uh, my cousin in a golf cart. Um, and where was that? That golf was uh, that was in Oregon at a golf co- a golf course, and it, there was a, a hill. Basically, the only time I get to drive a vehicle is, is, is when it's a golf cart. That's like the rules. So. I've never driven a golf cart. Yeah, you're yeah, it's fun. fun. They're fun, but you can do some damage on them. And so I am. So I, at one point, I was going down the hill and I hit the brakes a little too hard or something. We did a 360, and my cousin just went flying. Oh no! My co- my cousins live in Georgia, and they have like a town where they drive around in golf carts. Like the kids are allowed to drive golf carts. Before they can drive, it's and the best feeling they ever. They drive around the whole town. And I've wow. never been there, but like I remember, the kids were so happy they moved there because they could drive golf carts. Because all, all it's a start town. stop. Because what I did in Florida it was like a start stop, mm-hmm. and I was like 16, 16, 15, 14. It was so much fun. It's pretty simple. I've never driven. Really that. simple. It's cars. so much fun. You drive a golf cart. So much fun. Wow. Yeah. So your cousin went flying. So what is the website that you like to? So, yes, the website would be visionarymedia.org. Okay. Yeah, and that's the best place to kind of sort of get in the loop with us. We're also on Facebook and Twitter and all that stuff. Right, and what are you looking to, to get bigger? Are you looking Definitely. to... Definitely. I mean, we're always looking for... Do you need to help people from all over the world? Yeah, uh-huh. I actually just got contacted by somebody in Scotland who's looking for nice. audio training. So one of the things that we do is we hook um, people up with trainers, teaching how to use logic and programs. With accessibility awesome. tools so they can access the software no matter what their visual acuity. And no matter where they are in the world. Yeah, exactly. So that's cool. wonderful. Yeah. yeah. So people yeah. contact us from all over. So we're always looking for good artists, we're always looking for people who want to get more involved, volunteer. Now do you have to be legally blind for that? To volunteer? Yeah. No, no, no. No. I mean if you just want to support the organization, you right, want, you know, come help us run a showcase or if you know a venue that would like to host us or you know, um, opportunities for our positions, you know, by all means. Now, do you, do, you, do you see, like, little kids come, too? You know, it's funny, yeah, there was, um, we had, we hosted a group of, of, of young kids with blindness in our, we're in our recording studio, and there was this one kid who was just, like, so super into it, like, I can tell, he's about 10, and I can tell that, yeah, I mean, like, he's one of those kids that's, you know, um, really intuitive with music, and he'll probably be... You know, fast forward six years or seven years before I'd be really into it. And he was like, My uncle wrote the theme song for cops. Wow. Oh. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Oh. Holy cow. So, wait, has Stevie Wonder ever been in touch with you guys? You know what's funny is we yes. actually just got a grant from, I don't that, but we, we just got a grant from ASCAP. This is it's like brand new news that we're just. Good for you. Finally able to announce, and they would—they want to name this grant in honor of Stevie Wonder. Good for him. Yeah. 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 Exactly. Yeah, that's Stevie. They're waiting for you. Come on down. Yeah. Come down to my Monday night jam. Six o'clock. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Do you have a favorite Stevie Wonder? That's probably one of my least favorite. But like in the city. I love Mr. No. So, Brooke, would you like to push a button? I would love to. I think it's a push a button. I like Mr. Mr. No. I'm going to push it. Oh, yay! Thank you so much. Thank you so much for that team. Keeping it rude. Who and who? What's that you say? Who and who? What's that you say? There's a quirky 